Game on everybody, I'm Ryan, and welcome back to another episode of, uh, me pissy, me getting all pissy about the first Zelda game. So yeah, we're back from, from grinding off all those, all those, uh, rupees, so that way I could get, so that way I could get a potion, so that way I could fight the boss! Uh, I really don't like the structure of this Zelda game. It's handled so much better in Link to the Past. So much better in Link to the Past. I actually haven't played Zelda 2. And I know people consider that to be the Black Sheep, but honestly, I consider this to be the Black Sheep. But then again, like I said, I haven't played Zelda 2. So, I imagine that I will, I will, completely, I will hate it the moment I actually play it. And Brock's gonna have to guide me through that one too, because um, I have no idea where I'm going in uh, Zelda 2. So can I just walk past these guys? Yay, I can! Hooray! Bye! Bye guys, I just wanna get past you guys, just so that way I can get to the boss. Just let me get to the boss. How about you just let me get to the boss? How about that? Isn't that a good idea? Isn't that a good idea? Does that, all that make sense in some way? I wonder if I play the flute here, will this hurt these guys? No, it won't. I thought I was onto something there. That could have been really cool if the, if the flute actually did something. That would have actually been really cool. Nice! Finally! Now that I got the- now that I beat the boss, I now get the fifth piece of the Triforce! Okay, so now that I got the fifth piece of the Triforce, I wonder if I should if I should continue on or if I should stop here. Huh. A natural a natural thing to think about is that I should pro on continuing. But then again, I hate this game. So I don't want to. But yet I might be forced to. Hmm, I think I know what I'll do. Yeah, I think I'm gonna actually, f I think I'm actually gonna do the next dungeon. Because uh, you guys are probably just gonna be like, do the next dungeon already. And that's probably what, that's probably what I'm gonna have to do anyway. Even if, even if Brock is here or not, I will have to do this. Because it's usually part of the occupation of being a YouTube Let's Player. You always have to beat the games. If you don't beat the game, you're a fucking loser. You're not a real gamer if you can't beat it. I'm gonna take the letter. Then I'll head down a bit. A bit. <sighs> right now I'm being a total bitch warrior about this. Not so much a bit warrior, but a bitch horrier. A bitch ass horrier. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Thank you. All right, let's do the next dungeon. Let's also save preemptively because I'm not gonna enjoy this. Now, before I actually face the face the dungeon. A plane flew over my flew over my house. You guys didn't hear it, but a plane flew over my house. I hope you guys heard it, but you probably didn't. Okay, um Okay. So now let's look at the map for this dungeon. Ah fuck. This dungeon is a clusterfuck right here.
Well, from what I'm looking at, I think I'm going to have to go... I think I'm going to have to take a few shortcuts here and there. So it looks like I'm going to have to go... I'm going to have to go left. Then I'm going to have to go up. Until I until there's a bomb of a wall and then goes to the right. All right, here we go. I didn't want to, but I got to. Ah, no, 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 no! Wiz robes. Ah, oh, these are the these are the second worst enemy in this game. Wiz robes. They are terrible. I like the slime dudes. I like the slime dudes. They're at least, like, slow enough where I can at least stab them. Because, you know, thanks to these horrible controls, I'm able to gra I'm able to kill them. Which is a very good thing, I have to add. That is a good thing. Having enemies that you can kill is a good thing. Having enemies that you can't kill is a very bad thing. You know, funny thing, guys. Um, when I first played uh, Resident Evil Remake, you know what the f you know what the first thing I did was. Um, what I did in re in the Resident Evil Remake is I made sure that I killed every zombie. I know you're not supposed to do that, but I did. But also, it doesn't. I'm I was also playing on really easy mode. Oh no 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 God's sake stop moving Okay Okay Ooh died dead 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 Okay Dead Okay, I feel like it's now a need for me to use this. Isn't that an enjoyable sound? That's totally not ear grating at all. No! Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Yada yada. So wait, I gotta push, I gotta push a block. That's what it looks like I gotta do. I gotta push a block, then move right, and then move up. Oh wait, I gotta move down? Ah. Ah, uh, get away from me, Wiz Robes. I don't like you. I don't like you. I don't like you. No! Go away! Go away! No! No! I wanted to walk on the rail. I wanted to walk on the rail. I wanted to walk down. No! 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 No, 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 no. And now I gotta use a potion. Thanks, Wibs Robes, for being a bunch of pricks. Now I know I know you guys are probably thinking, why don't you just why not why don't you just use your safe states and all that? Well, you know what? Part of me wants to, but at the same part time, part of me doesn't want to. I kind of want to use safe states for like uh for like games that are really hard, like the games that truly deserve safe states. This one I can at least have. Some indication of how to beat. No, 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 no,
Go away, bats. At least it's just like likes. Imagine a room like with a. Uh, imagine if one of the rooms that was required to actually beat a dungeon had nothing but dark nuts and whiz robes. If they had that, this game would be fucking unplayable. Okay, okay. Okay! I miss Donkey Kong 64. I miss Donkey Kong 64 so much. Okay, okay, okay. Oh shit, we're right next to the, we're right next to the boss actually. Ooh, nice. I like it. But there's also a treasure that we gotta get. Do I actually want to get it? Is it actually required for me to beat for for me to use this this said treasure? Let's see. What is this so-called said treasure? Magic wand. The magic wand. Do I really want the magic wand? I really don't think I really need it. I feel like I should get it, but at the same time, I don't want to. Ah, <sighs> oh, whatever. Whatever. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh no! Oh no! I can just stay on top of this lava forever and no- and they can't- it won't harm me under any circumstance. No 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 no! 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 Ugh. Can I just walk into the dungeon? Thank you. 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 Okay. Okay. Boom. Yes. I did it. I did it. And now I get the next piece of the Triforce. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, at least, at least the very worst of it is all over now. I think there's actually one more that's actually really bad. Hmm. Okay, okay, there's one more dungeon left. And I will, I will be back for the next recording session with Brock. And I will take on, I will take on Dungeon 7 and Dungeon 8. And then afterwards, we fight Ganon. But yeah, we'll do all that in the next episode. So, that is all for this episode, everybody. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like, leave a comment, share with your friends, check us out on Twitter, Dailymotion, and Twitch, and most importantly, subscribe. My name is Ryan, I hate this game, and we will see you guys in the next video. Peace!